السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو ناصر سوف ان دس ویڈیو آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شو یو ہاؤ یو کین ریموو دی پبلک فرام یو آر ایل ان لارا ویل سو ان لارا ویل موسٹلی پروجیکٹ بیسیکلی اسٹارٹیڈ فرام دا پبلک فولڈر سو وین وی کال دی پبلک فرام دا یو آر ایل دین دی لارا ویل پروجیکٹ رنس سو ان موسٹ کیسز وی ڈونٹ نیڈ دی پبلک فولڈر فار ایگزامپل اف آئی کال ڈائریکٹ مائی پروجیکٹ دین دا پروجیکٹ شوڈ لوڈیڈ سو ہاؤ یو کین بیسیکلی ریموو دی پبلک فرام یور پروجیکٹ so basically we not remove we just uh, on the code handle uh, code side we will handle this issue okay so the first thing is inside the public folder you need to move some file to the root to the project root the first file is this one this one this and this so cut these uh, four files from the public folder and paste inside the project root okay so after that inside the public only my css files are there The second step is inside the root open the server.php in any editor you want and inside the server.php replace the public folder here okay just remove this one and save the file after that inside the root open the index.php in any editor and inside the index.php now here basically we uh, remove this thing on now our wonder is just like inside the root the bootstrap is inside the root not inside the public so just remove this one and save the file after that the last step is update your dot environment file okay open the environment file that is inside the root okay of the project this one open it inside an any editor this this is the environment file and inside the environment file we need two thing inside the app url your app url and we add asset url the asset url is basically your local host or for example if you deploy the live that that inside the local host there your domain will be your ip will be or your ip will be and after that forward slash public so my asset url is forward slash public okay and here if i re refresh here you can see that my project loaded successfully so this is how you can remove the public from the url in laravel so hope this video will help you a lot if you have any question on the video comment section you can ask your question or the question link is mentioned in video description just call that link i will answer it to you don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos